welcome my sweet friends happy saturday or you know whatever day you're watching this um in case you're new here my name is rebecca i am 24 years old and i live in durham north carolina and i could not be happier to be spending my weekend with you we have some errands to run we also are just gonna be cozy at home. I'm actually about to go into my Pilates class. Um, and yeah, it's just gonna be a chill time. I am actually really excited because we are actually filming on my phone right now because somehow my lens broke during our last little vlogging adventure hangout sesh and I was really scared that I was going to have to like buy a completely new camera or that the repair was just going to be astronomical and take 10,000 lifetimes. But shout out to Southeastern Camera in Carbro because I took my camera over to them and within a week they were like, hey girl, we got you a fresh new camera. So we're going to go pick that up after this, but I am so excited. And yeah, it's just going to be a lovely little time. The sun is shining. The weather is slowly but surely warming up. And I don't know about you, but as soon as it hits 60 degrees and the sun's out, I'm a new person. Just rejuvenated. I It's just the best. So yeah, I hope you are excited. And let's just get this day started. We are back in business. Oh my gosh. This feels good. Was that $500? Yes. Uh, but we are back. This feels good. And now it is time to go run some errands. I want to run to Ulta because I have some gift cards and I think I want to try gua sha I don't know if I'm pronouncing that 100% correctly. But basically, I have the worst dark circles you've actually ever seen in your life. And they've just been permanent for as long as I can remember. And I feel like I've tried a ton of eye creams and nothing is just really doing it. So I kind of saw online that it can help reduce dark circles. So... I'm gonna go get the stuff for that and then I need to drop off some returns. I'm gonna return these nails that I got at Target during our last vlog because I went on Olive and June's website and they had some other colors that I think I wanna try more. And then I need to drop this off at Whole Foods. That's an Amazon return, but yes, I'm so excited. And let's just keep this day going. I'm so happy. Should I go away? Hey everybody, welcome back to- I haven't really done this with you around. No, no. You're freaking me out, I'm gonna go in here. What are you doing? I was just gonna say that I'm back at home and that you have some goodies to show. Okay, go ahead. Boom, boom, boom. What are you doing? You're not supposed to be showing my goodies. <laughs> the world isn't supposed oh, to know this. Oh, that's gonna be upside down. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, so basically, um, Cole went to a card show and got some Pokemon cards for Hi, us Eliza. to open up. <laughs> it's been a while since we opened Pokemon cards. For mm -hmm. money. Apparently. <laughs> right. Instead of escort cards, we'll just give everybody a Pokemon card for the wedding. Hello, viewers. Do we still have to do the, this goes down? I got one away. No, you just, you just get one. I just flip and go. Yeah, Look, I knew what I was doing. Aww. I think you just go. I think they changed it. And I think the last couple, that'll be like. That's where the good ones are? Yeah. Not the last, last one. I really can't see what I'm pulling. I'm just trying to show off to the world. <laughs> Ooh, there's a shiny one. Mm hmm. 
That's a reverse. A reverse, reverse. Get a good... There's two reverses, and then that's a rare, the last one is. Oh. I just got an energy. Oh, Pikachu in the street. What I got. Oh my god, that is way cuter than the one I got. Here, show your viewers. Guys, show the viewers. Look at how cute. That's precious. This one looks like Dumbo. Does it? What is it? <laughs> one thing I'm trying to be better about this year is cleaning my hairbrush. Cole has no shame in telling me when it's disgusting. Um, so I cleaned it once in January. It's the end of February, but it counts. So we're gonna clean it. So we're Alexa, set a timer for 10 minutes. Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. Low fall. Loaf is like by far our favorite bakery in downtown Durham and having it in walking distance is very dangerous. Um, but I was so excited because they had one of my absolute favorite treats there. It is their almond croissant. I'm She's stunning. So yeah, and then Cole got a cinnamon roll, which I don't think we've tried before, so that will be fun. Bon appetit. All right, so it's about two o'clock now. Cole and I just finished filming a little Q&A from our wedding photographer, um, just so she can like get to know us a little better. And that was really fun. Um, and I think we're gonna hang out with some friends around like three, so to kill some time, I think I'm gonna play some Disney Dreamlight Valley. I played it for the first time in like forever last weekend. And I was kind of like, man, I miss this a little bit. So I think that's what, we're gonna get up to while we just wait to finalize some plans with our friends. We are all done hanging out with friends. We sat outside for a little bit, came back, played some Guitar Hero, went to dinner and got some really good food at Pizza Toro downtown. It was delicious. Uh, what are you saying? I have to rank Pizza Toro. Oh, uh, it's a belly? Yeah. Cole, Cole's on this app called Belly. Belly? Let me see. It's the app, yeah. With the camera. Follow me. <laughs> He's gonna rank Pizza Toro. Follow me on Letterboxd too. Oh. <laughs> is it all Cole underscore five 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 five? It is for Belly. I don't know what my Letterboxd is. <laughs> I think it's the same. Um, but yeah, it was a nice time. We came back. We watched uh, the <laughs> Deal or No Deal channel, the Supermarket Sweep channel. Supermarket Sweep channel makes us seem like we're 
Very lame. <laughs> it was kind of interesting. Um, and yeah, it was nice. But I'm going to go clean my face. Maybe I'll try my gua sha. And then it's reading time. Cole, you want to tell everybody about the book that you're reading right now? <laughs> I'm reading a book about dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. Dinosaur history. Oh, he's but one. Yeah, I'm doing the tandem read in Throne of Glass right now, and it's um, taking me a hot minute. So I was hoping to read more today, so maybe we'll make tomorrow a more heavy reading day. But yes, time to get comfy. After some research, I think I'm going to cleanse my face, then try gua sha -ing, and then finish with the rest of my skincare. I'm really, I'm not 100% though. <laughs> it's very conflicting research, but I think that's the route I'm gonna go. I'm gonna follow this video, and in case you're curious, I got the Eco Tools, um, like a jade gua sha, and I'm using the Ordinary 100% Organic Cold Pressed Rose Hip Seed Oil. So let's give this a go. Okay, well, my skin is a little red but I really wasn't applying that much pressure so maybe my skin just has to get used to the oil a little bit but next up I'm just gonna do a toner a serum and my moisturizer and hopefully my skin <laughs> will look better in the morning okay, my face is still um a little red which is like kind of tries me out but i don't want to think about it too much so as i mentioned earlier i am currently doing the tandem read for throne of glass and i'm currently on chapter 39 of empire of storms which i didn't check off yesterday but i'm on chapter 39 so like just about halfway through the entirety of the tandem read. I'm a little disappointed because the tandem read is taking has taken me much longer than I anticipated. My goal was to finish it by the end of the month, which I very well could do if I have like a pretty hefty reading day tomorrow. We'll see. Um, but so far I'm enjoying it. Neither book has been like like an out of body experience. Like I haven't had like an intense reaction to anything that's happened in either of them yet so I'm kind of anticipating to get that feeling soon since I'm in sort of like a bigger chunk of Empire of Storms but yes I'm just going to sit here and read until it's time to go to bed but yeah otherwise I will catch up with you tomorrow
when you sound. Yeah. Hello. Good morning and happy Sunday. Um, I just finished eating breakfast and working on our grocery list for the week. Um, and while Cole is at Orange Theory this morning, I am going to try and get a head start on some cleaning and chores. Laundry is our Sunday. La Sunday is our laundry day, so I'll get um, a load of that started, a load of the dishwasher, just like little things like that. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to today. I have a little date planned for Cole, but he's like already guessed what exactly all of it is. Um, and then we actually have a house tour today, so we will see how that goes. Um, but it should be a nice day. The sun's shining, which is nice, even though it's still a little chilly, but yeah. Let's get some things going around the house though. Cole is so kindly doing all of the grocery shopping today. I figured I would take the trash out, which is not my favorite and obviously is a boy chore, but I'm gonna take one for the team since we normally do grocery shopping together. <laughs> Except he's driving, so it kind of loses its charm a little bit. But first stop on Cole State is gonna be, I believe it's called Wolfpack Outfitters, because he recently got accepted into NC State to go to grad school, and we are just, we're just so proud of him. Who's we? Me. And. Okay. We're so proud of you. You and Eliza. So, <laughs> we are gonna go get him a little something to, you know, commemorate this exciting new chapter. Okay. He's already being a little bit dramatic about it because we can't switch allegiances. We are true to Georgia Tech. Well, you're true to From now so. until forever. Um, but yes, that's gonna be stop number one. And then stop number two is going to be Backyard Bistro, which seems to be a very, very popular restaurant. Is it? In the area. So, you know, we have to check it off the, the bucket list, you know, the must do's, the, the iconic spots. Um, 
and then we'll see where we're at with time. How's that sound? Sounds great. Okay. currently trying to fix my shoe the heel like popped out and now the little peg is all curved so it's supposed to, the peg is supposed to go in this hole in here? that little hole yeah how the heck did you manage to do this i don't know the problem is you got like straight peg yeah like that's why i was like trying to get the other one i don't know how i bent it though like, i can get it i just got it in, oh that's it's, perfect it's bent though so it's not gonna be perfect that's okay Oh, you super glue it sometime. What did you think of lunch? We have some hush puppies to go. Um, those are pretty delicious. Where did it fall on your belly at? Seven out of eight. Seven out of eight. Yikes. I didn't think it was that. <laughs> it's not great for backyard bistro. Our waitress was really nice though. Waitress was really nice. That's always a win. All right, now Cole, do do? show everybody the souvenir that you picked from the NC State School store. It's got a receipt on here. Got oh. Purvis Tumblr. Purvis Tumblr. Take it out of the bag. Oh. Okay. You gotta do the hand behind. God, Bob. Wow, look at that. He's so excited to go back to school. <laughs> <laughs> We're back from all of our adventures. After lunch, we went to the comic book store. And then we went and toured a home and it went pretty good, but it's seeming like it might just be a little. It's a gamble. Yeah, I'm we not the most optimistic. Well, I mean, I'm optimistic if, it, if we win the gamble. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so we'll see how that goes. But I would just like to say, Cole told me that I looked like I was in Greece. Because, uh, OMG, you look like you're in Greece. And I thought he meant like, I looked like I could be in Greece, the country, which didn't really make sense to me because this is really giving Greece, but I was flattered. I was like, wow, thank you. And he was like, Oh no, the movie. I'm looking at. And that really wasn't uh, the vibes. And then he started serenading me with Grease Lightning. Oh, Grease Lightning? Oh, so, yeah. this is the outfit. It's giving me, me Sandy vibes. Of the day. Ready to put us next to each other. <laughs> you don't look. I don't know, the jacket kind of does it. I don't know. The jacket kind of does it. There we go. Um, so... Also, also, I want to say, I haven't seen Greece in probably 15 years. Oh. Yeah. So I don't know. Yeah. Um, but now we're just gonna hang out. We're gonna watch Love is Blind. Roll up some coins. And then we have a call so cool. with a catering company tomorrow. So we need to go over their menu and highlight some of our favorite things. Right. Yeah. Did you have fun on your date? I... I Jeez, stutters. I always have a great time with Rebecca Carey. She is the love of my life. Don't act like I'm holding you at gunpoint or anything. <laughs> sweet potato top waffle. You like sweet potatoes? Sure, go ahead and highlight it. Okay. Can, I the, can I see the highlighter? Yeah. Cool. Just a crab and corn hush puppy. Hello, chicken. Do that, whatever that is. This thing. Mm. Oh my god, that is sinful. Look at what he just said. That's how I was highlighting. Okay, that's how you highlight something. What is this criminal act? It's a lot easier for me to do it when I'm standing behind you. Like oh my that. gosh. You like that more than the mini chicken taco? Mini chicken taco has pickled red onions and black beans also. Okay, fair. 
pork order. <laughs> Trying to face up the camera. Um, considering I'm just going to spend the rest of the night sitting in bed and reading, um, I will probably just end this vlog here. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and I hope you enjoyed all of our little adventures. Um, but yeah, thank you so much and I will see you in the next one.